Yes, and I've also got, I've got this toy airplane that you're gonna love watching buzz all over the place. Yes, you are. We can take it up high, way, 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 way up, all the way up, all the way up through the clouds. Oh, the looks like love to me. Yeah, I'm crazy about her. Oh, no, I was talking about Miranda. She's nuts about you. No. Ryan, are you sure about this? About what? The transfer of power? Miranda's alive. She's right here. Right? Here you go. Here's the Come here. Come yeah. here. Yeah. <gasps> Best place in the whole world, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Back where you belong. Mm -hmm. And Uncle Ryan is going to make sure that you get everything that belongs to you. It's a lot of money. <laughs> yes, it is. But what is money compared to this? Huh? What is it? I want the Miranda Montgomery Center to continue. Absolutely. <laughs> we just have to drop the word memorial. And, and maybe we should think about providing other services, like locating lost children, maybe counseling their parents. Just, you know, blue sky. So you're planning to stay on the board? As long as you'll have me. Oh, Ryan, that's such a relief. You know, we haven't really discussed the nuts and bolts of your resigning from Cambius yet. What would you like to know? Well, you have certainly made us a lot of money over this past year. I mean, just your work with Fusion alone, you, you deserve a great big fat severance package. Well, I don't need it. But you've done a great job. And I was happy to do it. No, Ryan, you're, you're losing a fortune. No, you see, technically I'm not losing anything. Turns out that it was only on loan. Bianca, you're looking at the happiest guy and the luckiest guy in the entire world. I got to see you reuniting with this miracle. Yeah. And I've got a beautiful wife that I love more than anything. You hear that? Miranda, you and me? We got it made. Well, don't forget <laughs> me and Greenlee in that picture. I think all four of us have got it made. Yeah? Might be five soon. Mm. Ryan. What? You and Greenlee are gonna... Well, we're thinking about it, you know? We're, uh... Thinking about it soon. Oh, yeah, I know. It's nice after such oh, a crazy year. That's amazing. Crazy, crazy year to have your priorities straight. <laughs> well, I'm so happy for you. And Greenway. Thank you. I got it all. I feel like I have it all. Right? Yes, I do. Doesn't it feels so good to be in a place where I don't have to prove anything to anybody. I know what you mean. You know, I'm sure that we can still find a way to keep you on at Cambius. I, I think I can hey, convince the Bianca, board. Bianca, we've been over this. You don't want to stray down the board right off the bat. It's not going to make you any friends. And with Ethan holding half the company, you're going to need all the friends that you well, can get. Well, I'm sure that I can I can make Ethan agree with me. I'm sure that I can no, talk him nah, into it. Uh, a, I don't want to. And B, you don't want to start with Ethan thinking he's done you any favors, all right? And, you know, expecting payback. Oh, right. But Ethan is, is not like that. It's... It... No, no buts. You are the munificent, fair, and kind partner. I want you to carve out that niche, and I want you to stay Mom, in it. Mom. And Ethan? Ethan. Ethan, Ethan. Well, we're just going to have to stay tuned, and we're going to have to see how it turns out. But the point is, you, not you, you need a right-hand man. You really do. You need someone. You need someone who's going to get your back all the time. A hatchet man, if you need one. Gosh, it sounds like war. Well, you got to remember who you're doing it for. You're just safeguarding your future, that's all. I don't, I don't have a lieutenant who will fight my battles for me and lay down his life for me. Punctuality is a plus two. Will you excuse me for a minute, please? Who's that? Who's that? Uh, would I let you go into the Cambius craziness all by yourself? I wouldn't let you do that. Behind this door is your right hand man, unless you ordered a breakfast pizza. <laughs> no, I did not. Who's there? Who's <laughs> <Who's coming laughs> <laughs> Uncle Jack? Actually, that's Senior Vice President General Counsel, Uncle Jack. That is, if you like my resume. Oh, Uncle Jack, I love <laughs> you so much. So does that mean I have the job? I think it looks pretty good. <laughs> I think Ryan's right. <laughs> what do you think? Hello. Ryan, 
It's Edmund. I need you at the hospital. Why? Was there an accident? Was it Maria? No. No. Listen, it's about the attempt on your life. Some new evidence has come to light. Well, I'll be right there. Meet me in room nine. <laughs>